Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is uh, basically three uh, 164s, and in here is actually two, which does equal five, because, you know, normally I do five uh, in reviews, and um, there's actually two in here. I'll explain in a minute. But first, for these, we have David Reagan's number 38 2017 Shriners car. We have Martin Truex Jr.'s 2018 Ducks Unlimited car. And we have Dale Jr.'s Xfinity Series uh, 2016 Goodies, number 88. So here um, is, as I said, two cars in one. Got this. So here's a little story. This is something on Black Friday from Plan B. It's a $35 value currently. Um, the Black Friday... It, no one was buying it and by monday it was literally down to five dollars <laughs> now you know this wasn't like a necessity thing or anything it's just you know two car a 124 car and a 164 car for five dollars when the there's an option for just the 124 and that was still like 16 dollars or something <laughs> so to have a 35 five dollar value go down to five for two cars it's pretty cool anyway as you can see and probably been staring at it by now this is a 1997 uh wally dolan back car uh woody wooden but woody woodpecker and custom box and stuff as pretty much all of them were back in the day this is made by revel which the if you don't know revel they have you know custom stands and stuff for all their cars too all uh, and this one actually doesn't for the 124 but for the 164 it does uh some more this is one of 1002 this is a bank the 124 is a bank by the way but it's you'll see it, it it's still pretty much a die cast um there you go legal stuff um die cast metal replica yeah more stuff info on the back And a penguin. <laughs> uh, but anyway, uh, let's uh, gonna pause the video and let's get this all open. Okay, so this is opening the big box. First thing, certificate, certificate of authenticity, certifies 124 scale diecast bank and 164 scale diecast replica of the 1997 Universal Studios Woody Woodpecker Chevrolet Monte Carlo driven by Wally Dollenbeck is one of 1,002 pieces. This has a styrofoam thing on it, paper and stuff. This actually was really well covering the 124. I have opened this before, which is why I wasn't, which is why it's pretty loose in there. So that's the 164, and this is the 124. Might as well take a look at the 124 here. And there is a difference, I will point out. The back on the 164 it does have stuff, but here it doesn't because that's where you insert money <laughs> it does have a key on the bottom but as you can see for the most part it's a die cast it has interior and stuff and yeah so it is very much still a die cast even though it's also a bank um but anyway the main color on this i would say is the blue um the whole hood is yellow and it's literally only the hood everything around it's blue the whole roof including a little bit outside is yellow and same thing well not same thing the deck lid itself is just yellow and then you have this little almost like a bow tie sort of design with the yellow surrounded by the black outline a little thinner over here woody woodpecker uh face there and really for the paint scheme that's it you have evil guy i never <laughs> watched any of this this is like obviously way before my time i was born in 2000 this car ran in 97 uh, so no idea who that guy is. Assuming bad guy. Um, Woodpecker logo. Uh, little Another one down there. <laughs> and you have the penguin on this side. And basically same kind of design on that. And then you have a lot of ha-has on the back. Um, yeah. So... All the numbers are kind of like this Cartoon Network style. Number 46 has some kind of shimmering to it as well. Uh, red with the black outlines. 
for both. Does I forget? Does this hood open? And if it does, can I get it without? Actually, I'm gonna pause it real quick just to make sure. And yes, the hood does open. So like I said, it's very much a die cast, even though it's also a bank. Uh, yellow interior of the hood, and there's your engine detail. Pretty good stuff. Um, and yeah, sponsors. Universal Studios, uh, Woody Woodpecker, <laughs> really nothing else. There's not a whole lot of sponsorship on there. You have your contentiencies, but uh, what is that? I have to, what is that? Matco Tools is a sponsor there. I don't think I showed the deck lid, but another Woodpecker ha ha stuff. Honestly, that is the only ads on this entire thing. So uh, without further ado, let's open up the rest of these. Okay, so here's the 164. Here's this really fancy. I didn't actually didn't mention the case. It's more the base that I was talking about. You see official Revel on the top there. Now I know where these came from because we have a ton of these in the attic and I never really knew where they came from. Now I do. So, ooh, it's on a screw. I will be right back. I didn't realize this was on a screw and everything too. Because as it turns out, something is up with this screw. I don't know what, but uh, I got it a little looser but you know it can't come off for some reason it looks like a normal screw but really i don't know i kept spinning and spinning nothing was happening eventually it did i did have initial progress but it never actually came off which i mean is fine um because it has a special base and everything i'm gonna keep it on the base anyway but you know it would be cool to have that option uh but anyway uh not really much go over on the car itself same paint scheme except for the back you have this added stuff guess who and then woodpecker and then number 46 universal studios and really that's about it uh the stand is the rebel collection and the wally dollenback signature over there in the corner so pretty cool this will go somewhere down here uh do i have room here let's move the box let's put that in there there you go, right next to the uh, Ken Schrader Revel one, which I never took off the base either. So, um, so yeah, and now let's move this box. Here you go. Good stuff. Good stuff. I, you couldn't even see that last part. Interesting. And I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Probably put it in up, up in the attic. Um, anyway, on to these cars, to the more modern cars. You have 2018 Martin Truex Jr. Ducks Unlimited right here. Main color is black. The, you kind of have this orangey red start up here. Um, go around the grill a little bit. Thick line that kind of separates into two then stops at the NASCAR race car logo. Have this line here. Kind of this half oval. Starts as dark blue. Fades into green then back to dark blue. Again kind of ends at the window over here. Then same thing over here couple other lines that do the same thing have the duck logo right there which has the same green and blue fade effect on it the beak is green and really that's the extent of the paint scheme but still cool um all the numbers i believe are white with this with the green and blue fade outline actually well i'm turning up my brightness here here we go um, so yeah, it has that fade thing again. Uh, sponsors, you have Bass Pro Shops, Ducks Unlimited, Bass Pro Shops, uh, four wind stickers at the time, Trek Boats, Toyota, Denver Mattress, Cabela's Auto Owners on the back, you have Trek Boats, Deck Lady of Ducks Unlimited, some of the styrofoam <laughs> cut on that, and BassPro.com on the roof. Next, we have... David Reagan's Shriners Hospitals for Children car. That star film is still stuck on me. Main color on this is this kind of teal blue. Uh, the roof, including the A post and the C post, are red. Um, then this red stripe kind of starts at the headlight, gets a little thicker, and kind of ends right here. A little bit of gap in between that and this other thing in gray, which has a black outline. Starts right in front of the wheel and then goes all throughout the quarter panel as well. And actually along the bottom as well. The bottom of the back is also in that gray. So um, all the numbers are 
green. Actually, I think they're a little bit different. Side numbers are white with the red and blue outline, and the roof is just white with blue outline. Sponsor, your Shriners Hospitals for Children. Trademark. Uh, Shriners Hospitals. There's a little Shriner logo over there. Safe to clean juice, does that say? You have all these down here. Zach. Uh, Racing Electronics is really the only ones I can make out. Uh, SEM, Ford, some other stuff. Back here, what is this? Uh, 95th Anniversary, I assume a Shriners. Love to the rescue.org. Declid, 95th Anniversary again, 1922 to 2017. Shriners Hospital for Children on the Roof. Finally, we have Dale Jr.'s 2016 X-Men New Series Goodies uh, Mixed Fruit Blast. Uh, main sponsor on, or I'm sorry, main color on this, I would think, is the purple. Splitter is yellow. Uh, the blue here in the front kind of goes over to the, to the side here. The whole side skirt is blue, but then kind of right with the rest of the car, right after the number kind of fades from blue into the purple. And really, that's that's the whole paint scheme. <laughs> um, the roof is kind of not a part of the blue, although the A post is also blue. Um, all the numbers are white with the red and blue outlines. Sponsors, you have Fast Pain Relief, Goodies Mixed Fruit Blast, Goodies Mixed Fruit Blast again, TaxLayer.com, Cessna, Armor, One Main, Hellman's, Hunt Brothers Pizza, Stripes, Exalta, Sun Energy 1, Valvoline, what is this? Don't know what that is. And don't feel like reading all that. Um, have goodies, fast pain relief, phrasing electronics on the side. Declad, you have Fire Alarm Services, Services Inc. And on the roof, you have goodies. So that is it for this video. Thanks for watching, guys. Um... Pretty cool stuff. Still stuff to come. Other than that, thanks for watching, and I will see you all later.